Deputy Senate President Ovio Magege has said that the Delta State Governor, Senator Ifean Yokoa, spends two billion naira on political appointees in the state every month. When he can't even pay retirees their monthly pension, having worked for 35 years, Omagege made a statement at the uh, declaration for the APC uh, governorship aspirant in a worried Delta State. Delta State correspondent Apomajor Friday reported that Omagege said that the present government of the PDP in the state has failed Delta in all sectors and that it's time for everyone to wake up and vote out such a party. Our civil servants, our parents who gave their life, the best part of their life, in the service of this state. Some of them have retired in eight, nine, ten years. Up to today, they have not been paid their retirement uh, benefits. Meanwhile, Okowa is busy every day employing a... Uh, 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 <laughs> Eh? I never talk much like that. Oh no, no, Abi. Okowa spends two billion naira, two billion naira every month on these people who do not contribute anything to governance. But our civil servants, our youths who need gainful employment, he will not give you jobs. Enough is. The State Commissioner for Information, uh, Charles Aniago, debunked the allegations made against Governor Ifyai Okoa. Aniago said those appointees are those helping the government to develop the 25 local government areas of the state. And that this shows that the Deputy Senate President is not on the ground to know what the government has done. We need to remind him that he needs to go and visit Obi Aruko and see what is going on with the Obi Aruko Bridge. We need to also tell him that before we came on board, from Indoqua West to Indoqua East, we were making use of what we call pontoon, a particular kind of boat that had to convey vehicles from Indoqua West to join our people in the Benegu houses, not to come and display their ignorance of the issues as they are on ground. He does not know that we are built bridges even very close to his community. It means he is not on ground. If he's not aware that a number of uh, secondary schools have been transformed and they now look like a university, it means that he's not very much on ground. If he's not aware that over 20,000 and by remotely more than 200,000 deltans, young ones, have been taken off the street on account of our empowerment programs, then it means he does not understand what it means to grow an economy of the state. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.